Yo, what is going on guys? Hope you're all doing super well. Today, we're going to talk, talk about the best Salmonid boss in Splatoon 2. So basically, for the Goldie, I'm kind of just going to like go into the numbers and like basically why it's better is because it just drops more. Like that's just like if that's what you came here, bro, that's why, bro. It drops more eggs. Like that's it. You can fucking leave now, but don't leave. Okay, I'm going to tell you why and give you a little bit of lore because lore is pretty spicy. All right. So additionally, um, like in the rush and fog modes the goatee has 500 hp and then in goatee scene it actually has 6500 hp um every tr every about 2000 it shrinks down to medium and then to small and then it's just you know it's fucking kermitting and it's dead um it can regenerate over time but that is that's i mean it's kind of rare so like it's kind of like it's there's two different ones because it's like the strong one but that's only in the goalie seeking and then you have like the regular one another thing also was from like the the page on it's called inkpedia you can fucking check it out if you want to it said that every hundred or sorry every ten thousand one of them was a goldie which is kind of bs because if you're in lower modes and you're not even in then you'll never get a goldie um if you're only count the like around or the certain ones like it's weird i don't know i guess that number is kind of like the roughest estimate you can get of an actual number because like what it depends what you're actually counting um and i have no idea what they're counting where they got that number from so if anyone does just tell me i don't know okay um so now i'm going to the drop right is like the, the biggest brain part of this whole thing so i did like a bunch i counted a bunch of matches and all that and youtube videos and my stuff so so the most i did like my matches which were like pro fresh 300 people who had max hazard level and people who were just like kind of starting off like a couple above part-timer it kind of depends like how you look at it so like technically like if i was gonna be like oh i would probably say like it depends it also kind of depends where you are because if you're lower you're probably gonna get three or five but if you're higher you're gonna get five or ten so but that was also kind of the same thing where i am i got more tens um my average was like was seven eggs instead of six because i probably because i'm higher but then once you get so high it probably like takes it down because then it gives you less eggs because then it's like harder to do if it gives you less eggs Basically, what you're gonna do is when you're going off thing, if you see one, don't kill it until it's like right next to your basket, okay? Make sure you get that thing right next to your basket, all right? Basically with like, you know, I mean, a bunch of this stuff, kind of like the same thing you should do with the scrapper, is you should just wait for it to get to your basket and then you kill it. And then especially with this, because if you get a 10, like you have to be running back and forth like the whole time and you're like, why would I run like 300 meters just to get one egg when I can have 10 right there and then just throw them in the basket, you know? Um, which is which is nice okay i mean if it's one then obviously it's like it doesn't matter or if you get three but still though that's like kind of like a, a known strategy you're done but it's kind of it's kind of obvious like you should just do that i mean it's also like the easiest to kill like you can literally kill it with anything and i mean obviously in the you know the all fucking goldie rush thing or whatever you know it takes a little bit to kill it but like even if you do you can get like 16 eggs or something like that um it's so like anywhere from 13 to like 17 eggs depending on how long you actually like take for you to kill it so that's a lot i mean they're like spread out but if you use like a nutty special or something you, you can use you megs so that's in my opinion the best salmon boss in splatoon 2 okay hope you guys have having a happy hoppy hoppy happy easter okay and until next time i will see you guys somewhere else peace